Good morning, everybody. Uh, welcome to our advanced Excel uh, lessons. This is lesson number five, and we're going to discuss mis mean, median, and mode. So these are functions uh, that we use in statistics. So let me show you the PowerPoint. So again, these materials are already uploaded in our Moodle. Okay. So this is uh, our PowerPoint presentation for the topic mean, median, and mode. So let's discuss the definition of this um, functions. And let's see what function are we going to use. Uh, mean or arithmetic mean uh, in non-statistical definition or mathematical common definition, uh, this is the same as average, okay? So how do we do this? For example, from your uh, example here, the average of 2, 3, 3, 5, 7, and 10, uh, so 2, 3, 3, 5, 7, 10, so these are a series of numbers, okay? 2, 3, 3, 5, 7, and 10, six numbers. So you add them all together and then divide it by the number, um, um, so it's 30 divided by 6, so the average is 5. That's what we call mean, okay? So it's easy. Uh, second definition is median. Now for the median, uh, this is called the central tendency, okay? So actually what we're going to do here is just identify the location of the center of a group of numbers in a statistical distribution, okay? So the first thing that we have to do um, is to identify the central, okay, the center of a group of numbers. So if you have here numbers of same uh, example that we gave uh, earlier for the mean, 2, 3, 3, 5, 7, and 10, okay, so we have six numbers. So look at me, six numbers. Okay, listen carefully. Uh, 2, 3, 3, 5, 7, and 10. So in the first position, you arrange it uh, from the lowest to the highest. Okay, so you have to sort it. You have to arrange it. So the, the, the first step of a series of data, if, for example, not only six numbers, there are more than six numbers, many, okay, uh, the first step is they will arrange it. Okay, then they will count the numbers. So what we're looking there is the position, the central position. For example, if you have five numbers, one, two, three, four, five, the central position is the third position. So here is, if it is an even uh, uh, counts, so it, uh, for example, we have six numbers, two, three, three, five, seven, and 10. The central position is the middle of the third number and the fourth number, okay? So the first number is two, the second number is three, the third number is three again, the fourth number is five, then the, uh, the, the fifth number is seven, and the sixth number is 10. So the answer here is four, why? Because since we have six, the central position is in between three and five. So what we uh, the function will do is to add and I know, or to get the average also of the third and the fourth position. So three and five, okay, two, three, three, five, seven, ten. So three and five, okay, average of that or the mean of that is four. Okay, so for example, you have five numbers, two, three, three, five, seven, two, three, three, five, seven. So the third position is the center, okay, or the central location of this. So two, three, three, five, seven. So the, the median is three, central tendency. We call it central tendency. Now let's go to the mode. Okay, the mode is the most frequently occurring number in a group of numbers. For example, then the mode 2, 3, 3, 5, 7, 10, the most uh, uh, frequently occurring. So frequently occurring. So for example, uh, you have 
numbers like 1, 1, 1, 2, 3. Okay? Frequently, most frequently occurring is 1. So the answer that to that is 1. Okay? For example, you have uh, many numbers here. He will find, uh, he will arrange first, of course. He will arrange. Okay? So if he found out the most number of occurring uh, number is like, six so six times it appeared the others on the third times it occurred so the answer should be six okay so anyway in the functions this is the definition of those three functions but in, in excel we're going to um what we're going to do is what's the next okay this is just a reference uh, what we're going to do in Excel is just to use the function, as simple as that. So I'm going to stop the presentation here, and you can download the, uh, the Excel file, example, okay? Uh, we're going to just do that example. Okay, so this is our example. We have series of numbers, okay? So column A, you have these numbers, okay? So here, you don't have to do the steps that I explained on how to get the mean, median, and mode. I ex just explained it, uh, the concept of that so that later on, uh, maybe in your analysis, in your thesis, if you have statistical analysis, then you can apply those theories that I uh, told you okay but in excel is easy it's just gonna be uh the functions that you will need okay so of course mean we said in the first uh, in our powerpoint mean is just uh the average okay so the we don't have a function mean in excel but we have the average okay so equals average okay and then just highlight this, okay? If you don't want to highlight and you know already um, uh, you, you know already the coverage from A2 until when, A22 is here. So if you want to just type it A2 colon, A22, so it should be range. And then close parenthesis, equal sign, the function average, so the, uh, the answer is 27.71, okay? The next is uh, median. This one, we have a function called median. So again, it's just the same, A22 A2 to A22, those parentheses, you're gonna get the answer, okay? So again, the idea of median is the central tendency. So he will arrange first the numbers and he will get the central position and whatever number is in there. Okay, if it is uh, like this is 21 numbers. So the 21 numbers, the central position of that is 11. So after sorted from lowest to highest, he will get the number in the 11th position okay 11th position not the cell 11 okay so don't don't uh confuse yourself anyway as i said you just need to know the theory behind and then in excel we're just going to do the function so the last is mode we have a function called mode and again a2 to a22 okay press enter so this this is easy Okay, so if you want to apply that, I will not type it again. I'm just going to copy it here. And voila, we have the answer. Sample number two is this the same in median mode. So it's just equal to average of this numbers. B1 to B14. This is just equal to median of B1 colon b14 close parenthesis enter then is equals to mode uh, b1 colon b14 
Okay, as you can see, it's four, which is the mode. Okay. Here is 23, this is 24. So later on, as I said, we are not here to discuss the st statistical application of this, but I just discussed the theory. So later on, if you have a statistics class or you have a thesis that will need this, you know how to use it. So that ends our presentation. Okay, so that ends our uh, lesson number five. That's how fast it is. It's just a short topic. We're just going to continue with lesson number six. So I'll catch you on our next lesson. Uh, have a nice day. Bye.